Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernard from the BTN HD. And if this is your first time checking me out, make sure to hit that subscribe button to get the latest and greatest on MDT videos. So uh, this is kind of a continuation of one of the videos that I did for you guys a while back uh, dealing with creating the Office 365 local package. Now I'm showing you guys how to deploy it with MDT. You know, I'm gonna show you how to import it and then uh, do the command, the correct command, so you could deploy it during your deployment process, right? So let's get started. So first thing that you need to do is open up your deployment workbench. Uh, for me, I love creating folders, so I highlighted the application node, right-clicked on it, and clicked on Nude Folder. Now, within the New Folder wizard, uh, I gave it a name of Office 365. Again, if you have been watching my MDT videos, I love creating folders for some reason. I don't know. Uh, click next, next, and finish. Done. Now, within the Office 365 folder, I'm going to right click on it and click on new application. You're going to get the new application wizard. Now, the option that you want is application with source files. This is the default one. So click on next. Now, you're going to give uh, details publisher, application name, version, and language. Now, for me, I gave it Microsoft. Uh, and the name will be Office 365, and for the language would be ENUS, English, United States, right? The version is really up to you. Click Next. Now the source directory. Now when you click on Browse, you're going to get this nice little dialog box and locate where your package is located, right? And for me, it's within uh, this Office 365 folder that we created together on the last video, so make sure you guys check that out. Now, I'm gonna show you guys within my Z drive, transfer, I got the O365, and this is everything that we created on the last video. Again, make sure you check that out because I show you guys how to get all this information, create the install bat and all that goodness. With MDT, I'm not going to use the install.bat. I'm actually going to use the setup uh, file, okay? Then, that's going to be your source directory. Click on next. Uh, destination. I'm going to leave it as is. Click on next. Now the command line. Now this is the secret sauce. Uh, without this, your installation won't work correctly or it won't install silently, right? So this is the command that I provided. Setup.exe forward slash config and I'm calling out my XML file. Now, if you followed or checked out the last video creating this package, within my install bat file, I actually called this out. Okay. Uh, the only thing I'm doing is I'm not using the install. I'm just using the direct command line within MDT. Then once you do that, click on next. Next again, it's going to start grabbing all those files and importing them inside your deployment share. And once everything is done, you get this. Click on finish. Done. Now, right click on it, go to properties, go to details. And again, I'm showing you guys this is the quiet install command. This is what's going to allow you to install it with no problem. Uh, again, this video is just showing you guys how to import it and setting up the command line correctly. Uh, if you want to know how I got all those particular files, check out the video that I did for you guys. I will post the link at the bottom, so don't freak out. And that's it, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this video. Leave comments right below, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.